Croxley Green is a village and large suburb of Rickmansworth in Hertfordshire, and a civil parish in England. Located on the A412 between Watford to the northeast and Rickmansworth to the southwest, it is approximately 20 miles 32 km northwest of central London. Croxley Green has changed considerably in the years since John Dickinson built paper mills in the area. The area has grown into a semi-urban community, thanks to Croxley Tube Station on the Metropolitan Line providing connections to London's West End at Baker Street and stations through to the city at Aldgate. The population at the 2011 census was 12,562. Topic History Croxley Green has a large village green. The Croxley Green Windmill was built c. 1860 and survives today converted to residential accommodation. The Green houses the Revels on the Green, an annual village fair which includes a traditional maypole dance, which used to be illustrated on the road signs on entering the village. The Revels were featured in Metroland, the 1973 television documentary by John Betjeman, who referred to them solemnly as a tradition dating back to 1952. The annual Mummers play, Street. George and the Dragon, is played out during the Christmas period at a number of village hostelries. Since 2006 the Parish Council have organized a firework display on the Green for New Year's Eve. Croxley Mill was built in 1830 adjacent to the Grand Union Canal by the paper manufacturer John Dickinson. Croxley Script Stationery used to be produced there by John Dickinson & Co. Limited. Dickinson Square, Dickinson Avenue, and Barton Way are streets named after the mill owner and some contain the houses built by the company for their workers at the end of the 19th century. The mill closed in 1980. In 1986, Croxley Common Moor to the south of the village, OS Grid Reference TQ083949, is a 39.5 hectare biological site of special scientific interest SSSI and local nature reserve. In 2008 a group of residents were successful in gaining village green status for Budlia Wood, a small area of woodland to the south of the village, thereby protecting the area for generations to come. The village signs were replaced in February 2008 with a scene of All Saints Church and the Green. Rail <inaudible> 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 Train services are provided from Croxley Station on the Watford branch of the London Underground Metropolitan Line, providing connections to London's West End at Baker Street and stations through to the city at Aldgate. The journey is between 40 and 45 minutes to Baker Street, and 60 minutes to the terminus at Aldgate. Churches. C of E All Saints Church, The Green C of E St. Oswald's Church, Malvern Way C of E Explore Church, Fuller Way Croxley Green Baptist Church, Baldwin's Lane Croxley Green Methodist Church, New Road Roman Catholic, St. Bede's, Baldwin's Lane Croxley Green Christian Assembly Schools Morris Minors Preschool Malvern Way Infant and Nursery School Little Green Junior School Harvey Road Primary School York Mead Primary School Rickmansworth School In 2016, Rickmansworth School took in an extra class of 30 students of which would now occur with every New Year group joining with £2.3 million funding to upgrade their facilities from the government. <laughs> York House School York House School is an independent preparatory day school for girls and boys aged from 3 to 13 years of age, located on Surratt Road near Croxley Green in Redheath, an 18th-century mansion. Redheath was built and rebuilt in stages by the Baldwin, Finch, and Baldwin-Finch families. The current features date variously from 1712, 1743 and 1866. The school was founded in Hampstead in 1910 by Rev. 
Cambridge Victor Hawkins. It relocated to Rickmansworth in the late 1940s, then moved again to its current location in 1966. The school motto is, Aut vium invenium aut facium, which is Latin for, Either I shall find a way or I shall make one. The school's alumni are referred to as Old Yorkists. Notable alumni include Alan King Hamilton, former Old Bailey judge, Sir John Sulston, Nobel Prize winner. Topic: <laughs> Local organizations. Croxley Green has a residents' association and a parish council. There are local organizations dedicated to pastimes and leisure. The Croxley Green Society runs the Revels, an event hosted on the Green in June, July every year. There are varying clubs including the Camera, Needlecraft, Wine, Vineyard, Bicycle, Jazz, and Folk. Additionally there is an annual free-of-charge festival, called Croxfest, which takes place on the Green in September. Notable residents Barbara Woodhouse the dog trainer presented Training Dogs the Woodhouse Way on television in the 1980s and lived at Campions from the 1940s to the 1980s. Fred Housego, the 1980 BBC Mastermind winner, and sometime London black cab driver. Ron Tarr, a British actor, best known for playing the part of Big Ron in EastEnders, lived in Dorrance Drive. In a report about Tar's death in the Daily Mirror, journalist Chris Hughes stated the character had a cult following. <laughs> 